we're going to cut this piece of wavy glass. We broke it out of another piece. This is a smaller sash, so we'll be able to use it. Um, the thing about wavy glass is that oftentimes it has a bow to it. And I don't know if you can capture that bow on the camera or not, but it goes like this. Okay? So, one of the things we've been talking about is how to not stress the glass so that it breaks, okay? A lot of lessons to learn, okay, about stressing glass. But look, I'll show you. I mean, so, see that right there? That's not a good stable table. You want a, some kind of a stable place to cut it. So I'm going to move this over here. Hopefully, it's stable. I like to just cut it in place. This piece of glass is gonna fit pretty good. So, now look, I've got, just lift it up a little bit right there. So, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take some tension off it. See how I'm lifting up here? I'm gonna take some tension off it so it's relaxed right there, okay? And as it gets there, I'm gonna, I'm gonna release a little bit here maybe come over here and take a little bit of pressure off there but we'll see it might be okay i'm gonna lift it here see ah oh, see it i can feel it breaking see it ah oh, see it's breaking right there ah uh, okay that's that pressure, okay? Yeah. Let's see if I can continue. Okay, so that may have been lucky. Got a little bit of tea sticking up right there, so I'm gonna use my teeth right there, and I'm just gonna yeah, nibble it. Nibbles it. Trash is here. Last bucket. So, it, it, is there a way, and is it necessary, to sand it smooth on glass? I mean, if you're going to hand it off to somebody who's unsuspecting, uh -huh. probably a good idea. Okay. But if you're doing it, and you're going to glaze it, and you're used to working with glass anyway, then okay. probably it doesn't really make a big deal. Right, see how that's it in there now okay uh -huh. now here's the other thing too is i cut it with a bow like this yeah okay actually and you want to install it so that here i'm gonna lift it up carefully okay uh -huh. install it so that that bow is up it's called the crown okay there so that see that's it's bowed up in the middle right there mm -hmm. okay you want to touch it on the ends okay and bowed up in the middle and when you bed that the the that's what bedding is for mm. okay mm -hmm. bedding is to make up that difference right there and provide you support for that bow you okay. see that okay 
Okay. It's really, really important. I mean, bedding sometimes, you know, I mean, you could take it or leave it in different circumstances, but this is one of those situations that explains the, the, the real need for bedding in old window work. Okay. I mean, it's a brand new sash. The, the glass is perfectly flat. I mean, there's arguments, you know, that would let you not do it. But mm -hmm. as a general rule, you know, it provides a nice seat there and then a nice support for that. So now that you're now that you have this piece, okay, mm -hmm. now you have to protect it. You know, when you take it out, gently supporting it, like so. Okay, we're talking about carrying it. Mm -hmm. Okay, a stress-free carry. You have to have a stress-free carry. So like, I'm gonna pick it up here. Okay, and look. See how that's stress-free? Okay, no stress on that. Okay, I mean I could carry it like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. That doesn't feel as good. You see? I mean, I could still, I don't, just, I don't know, it just doesn't feel good. Here, see, the stress isn't there. Now, I could also try carrying it like this. Let's see how stupid that would be. Okay? You see how, see how obvious it is that that's not the way to carry it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay? All right. So that's the way that we need to think about the glass, okay? So we need, you know... This is a nice, comfortable way to do it, okay? Not the only way, okay? You know, and somebody asked me earlier, I, I was holding a smaller piece one-handed. So, oh, so you carry it one-handed? No, no, you don't carry it one-handed, all right? I was carrying a piece one-handed, see? Well, back it up a little bit, see how I'm supporting the whole thing here, mm -hmm. okay? Slip that back down in here. Sometimes the safest place for a piece of glass is in the frame that you want it to be in. Now let me demonstrate holding a one piece, holding a glass with one piece, with one hand. Okay? Now that makes sense. See that? I, mean, I could hold it like this, you know, mm -hmm. but one hand is a little bit more obvious, right? So, mm -hmm. so anyway, that's what we're talking about. And that's a little bit of video on how to cut and handle and think about wavy glass.